Listen, Solo, I know. I know this is hard right now with Roman, but just tell him what he wants to hear. The bloodline was great. We can continue to be great. We can do what we were doing before dominating. You were dominating as the enforcer. I mean, come on, who wants to be tribal chief? So much pressure, so much work, so much weight on your shoulders. Me and Jimmy will win back the tag titles. You can go after the intercontinental title or the North American title. You got options now. There's so much for the bloodline to do right now. Just not give up on them. Listen, Moose, I'm not giving up on nothing. I'm going to create a better bloodline for us. A better bloodline for our bloodline. The bloodline. I'm going to do this for our family. Listen, man, after tonight, everything's going to be good. We got nothing to worry about. I'm going to fix this, all right? I'm going to do this for you. I'm going to do this for Jimmy. I'm going to do this for myself. And together, we're going to create a better bloodline. I think that's your cue. See you out there, Oz. Oh, man. Oh, man. Well, listen. Listen, listen. Before we get into this, I don't know how smart that was of, of, of Jay giving Solo a bit of a heads up before this one goes down, ladies and gentlemen. But so much story. So much history, rich history being coveted inside the bloodline. So many problems coming out of Survivor Series War Games that happened back in last October, ladies and gentlemen. What we are seeing, what we are seeing is a breakdown. What we are seeing, what we have been seeing are cracks. But the big question is, as we are on the precipice of WrestleMania, will those cracks continue to be a problem? Or will Roman Reigns solve that problem here tonight? Sola Sokoa is known as the enforcer. He is known as a problem for anybody who steps to the bloodline. But as of the last couple of months, he has been known as the problem of the bloodline. At one point, it was Jimmy and Jay on the top of the world. At one point, it was Solo Sokoa being one of the dangerous, one of the most dangerous people on this roster. And it was Roman Reigns leading the pack with a slimy Paul Heyman. And it was Roman Reigns' goal to getting to that World Heavyweight Championship. And Roman, every time he tries to go for that title, something just stops him from getting to that. Something just stops Roman from getting to his goals to becoming World's Heavyweight Champion. When it comes down to Roman Reigns and anything that Roman's tried to do, when it comes down to him and that World's Heavyweight Championship, there are consistent problems and Sola Sokoa looks like he is trying to be a consistent problem ladies and gentlemen ladies and gentlemen so much is going to go down in this summit all right this, this summit isn't your typical summit ladies and gentlemen this summit is a summit that listen when Roman calls them things either fix or things break and the last time we seen a summit of any kind before WrestleMania, it was called by Roman Reigns, and it was a shield summit. And Roman Reigns promised the WWE Universe that there were no cracks in the shield. And later after that, later in those couple of months, we seen how true that was. Will the same case bring out here tonight? I don't know, ladies and gentlemen, but Jay and Jimmy stand behind Roman Reigns. Nothing but aura that surrounds this man. The aura around this man speaks for itself. When you are standing in the ring with the tribal chief, things pick up, ladies and gentlemen. And if you ask me, things are picking up. Las Vegas, acknowledge me. Now listen, you can boo all you want you can cheer all you want but the fact will remain the same and that is this is a tribal summit our first ever tribal summit a summit that i have no problem explaining to each and every single person the rules of this summit and the rules are very simple i speak my piece solo speaks his piece and after solo speaks his piece he acknowledges his tribal chief 
and we go into WrestleMania smooth sailing. But if Solo decides tonight that he wants to go against the family, if Solo decides tonight that he wants to go against the bloodline, then I will have no choice than to put Solo Sokoa in his place. Now, I want to let everybody know this started because of Solo's lost. Because of Solo's downfall, the Bloodline struggled shortly after that. Jimmy and Jay here lost the Tag Team Championships. The Bloodline was never the same. And sure, you can sit down and you can say to yourself, Hey Roman, hey Roman, maybe, maybe the Bloodline isn't the way it is because you aren't holding the World Championship yet. Now why is that? That is because I have nothing on my mind than putting this family back together. You see, I would have walked out of No Way Out, World Heavyweight Champion. I would have walked out of No Way Out going to the main event of WrestleMania, but what happened? What happened? I, I, I was so in my head about Solo Sokoa. I was so in my head about fixing the problems between me and my cousin. I could not wrestle. I could not think straight. And what happened after I got eliminated? He decides to come on up the ramp and put his hands on his tribal chief. You see, that's something, that's something that I cannot stand for. That is what's brought us here. I refuse to sit here and be Solo Sokoa's punching bag. You see, Solo and needs to understand that he is a soldier. When Solo understands that he's a soldier, when Solo understands that he is an enforcer, not something that I put on Solo, something that his own father put on him, something that our ancestors put on him, but now he wants to deviate from his own path because he feels like he should be tribal chief. Where was that energy when I wasn't in the bloodline? Because just last year you were begging for me to come to the bloodline, and what did I do? I came, I fixed the problems that the bloodline had, and I made us one of the most relevant top factions here in universe mode, and what do I get as a thank you? I get a spike. What do I get as a thank you? I get so Solo Sokoa putting his hands on me when I should be standing here on Raw Old School in the main event face to face with Finn Balor in a contract signing but instead I have to indulge Solo Sokoa so you know what Solo get your ass out here and acknowledge me He's here. He is here and he is walking with a purpose. You see the shirt speaks for itself. Solo, the one problem. Will he continue to be that problem here tonight with everything that Roman Reigns has said? Oh man, oh man, I don't know. But Solo's a fish in a shark tank, I tell you. So this is what this is about, Tribal Chief. This is what this is about. This is still about that World Heavyweight Championship. Hmm? This is still about everything else than the bloodline. You see, the bloodline was brought together by our ancestors because we were supposed to be something great. We were supposed to be something on the absolute top of our mountain, but instead, manipulation came in by Roman Reigns. Instead, Roman Reigns decided that family wasn't important. Winning championships was more important. And you see, that's where our paths deviated, Roman Reigns. That's where we decided to go in different routes because since day one, since coming to the WWE, I have been by my brother's side. I have been with the bloodline, for the bloodline, about the bloodline. That is why I was an enforcer but you aren't about that. You are about doing things the Roman Reigns way. And if it isn't done your way, you cry about it. You bitch about it. You moan about it. What do you do instead of fixing the issue that you're in? You could have been World Heavyweight Champion. But instead, you sat here and, and you sat here and you ridiculed me for months for taking a loss at War Games when it didn't matter. It didn't matter. 
William Regal said after War Games, after we fought the Shield, that we were going our separate ways, that the war was getting too out of hand. So regardless of whether we win or lost, it did not matter. We went into War Games as a family. That is what mattered. Coming out, you could have easily won after Finn Balor for the World Heavyweight Championship, but instead, you decided to try to make an example out of me. But I am not somebody that you are going to make an example out of, Roman. I am not somebody that you're going to sit here and disrespect, Roman. You see what you said earlier before I came out here? Me acting like a soldier? See, that's your problem. That's your problem. You see, me, Jimmy, J, we're not your soldiers. We're your family. And you don't see us as that. So I think maybe it's time that I step up and be that tribal chief that everybody needs. I think it's time that I be that guy that sits at the head of the table for your family and mine. You know what? I'm not going to sit here and be disrespected by some punk street thug. You know what? Jimmy! What the hell? Jimmy, what the? What the? What? what? Dude, what the hell is he doing? Wait a minute, Jimmy, what are you doing? Jimmy, no! Jimmy just took out Solo! Jimmy just took out his little brother! What the hell is wrong with you? What are you doing? Get your ass out there and help your brother finish the job. Are you really gonna do this right now, Jay? Are you gonna defy me like your brother? Are you gonna do what your brother has done and that is disrespect the bloodline, Jay? You are better than this. You have more potential than your little brother. Don't let that go down the drain for Solo Sokoa, you hear me? You have a championship to win, championships to win at WrestleMania. Do not make an enemy out of me. Whoa, 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 Jay, not like this, not like this. Listen, Tribal Chief, listen, Tribal Chief, you don't mean nothing by it, all right? Listen, Jay's going through a lot. We got WrestleMania coming up. This is not personal, Roman, all right? Let's just, let's just keep up with the plan, all right? Bloodline business, right? Bloodline business. Well, it seems like, it seems like Jimmy was able to calm Roman off of Jay, but you can't think that Roman forgot about this. What does this mean for Solo? Is he out? 